The next drill we're going to cover is a single stick speed drill. This drill also deals with multiple um, lines of, of attack. Um, when we start the drill, we have to go one, two, as an X form, three, four, diagonally, five, six, horizontal. The first two strikes is collarbone, collarbone, then we strike to the hip, then the collarbone, and then we strike to the hip and the hip. It's important that when you start this drill, you start off slow because slow is smooth. And then as you pick up the speed, you can become fast. Slow is smooth, and smooth is fast. That would be a fast version. When we switch sides, we switch with our triangle footwork. Just like we did before in the footwork portion of the training. And this time we do a horizontal strike to switch hands as well. All right, and then from here, collarbone, collarbone, hip, collarbone, hip, hip. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Slow, smooth, and fast. And switch. Okay? Now we're going to change levels and we're going to apply the speed drill on the ground or on the knee. Example, when we start the first move, go into ducking position. Now you see why ducking is very important? We use it in a lot of our, our footwork or we use it in a lot of our training and you, you're going to see it in level 2, stage 3, you know, and so on. So when we go here, we drop down, it's the same thing. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six from the knee. Okay, now, although we're changing levels, okay, we can still fight in different ranges. Just because we're low does not mean that we cannot fight long. All right, so when we do this drill, is levels and uh, also practicing um, uh, ranges. So we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six. We switch back and on guard position. Always two hands on the stick. So this way, if I fumble my hand, which sometimes happens, you know, I will always have um, one hand gripping the stick uh, fully. Then when I switch, one, two, three, four, five, six, and again, one, two, three, four, five, six, and switch to the other side. You see how the hand fumbled? But I'm not going to drop my stick because I have a tight grip on this hand. So although it fumbles, I can still take an extra strike, re-grip, and continue my speed drill, and then back to guard. If you enjoyed this video, remember to like and subscribe today.